Welcome, folks, to our channel where we offer free and honest product reviews. I'm Alex. I'm Liz. Together, we are the review crew. We'll review almost, almost anything. anything. Today, the perfect spotlight spotlight for the price. This is the Browning High Noon USB rechargeable spotlight. 950 lumens. Why don't you tell them what lumens are? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we won't get into that. <laughs> About that. So. I said for the price, this spotlight is seventy-five thirty-eight, so fairly cheap on the spotlight spectrum. Where do you get one of these? I'm Amazon? not sure. I'm sure you can get them on it. Yeah, they were on mm -hmm. Amazon, but I'm sure at your local sporting goods store. Browning is a pretty popular brand okay. in the in the hunting world. Sure. So you won't know too much about that. Um, they had ten reviews on Amazon, so not many reviews, but it was four point seven out of five star rating. Okay. Um, they say the beam shines 550 yards, which that's, I mean, that's like that's quite a 500 bit. or five football fields. Yeah. I was shining it. It's not 550 yards, I mean, across, you know, the field across the way. And I wasn't quite getting to the tree line. I so. can't imagine it gets that far. No, it, but. I th thought that was a little far. For yeah. The, it has three settings, the high beam. Okay. So you you want to demonstrate? <laughs> Just Don't kidding. point it at me. So the high beam, I'm going to hit it once here. And then if you hold it, you got high beam, and then it's going to go to low beam, low beam right here. Okay, all right. And then I'm going to hold it a little longer. And then it's going to go to the flasher. Oh, well, that'll drive people crazy. Yep. Too. So this is the strobe setting. So Whew. the high beam, you know, if you want to try to see to that 550-yard range. Yeah. Low beam, if you just want a little bit of light, maybe if you're you know, outside and yeah. you're trying to find something and you don't Just need it. it for a flash. Yeah, kind of like more like a flashlight, but okay. very strong flashlight, mm -hmm. obviously. And the strobe, if you get in a car accident or something, or it's an emergency, oh. and you want somebody to see you. Or, kind of safety kind of feature. Yeah, safety yeah, feature. Nice. Or maybe if you want to scare a bear away, or a crazy ex-boyfriend. <laughs> or a keeps, husband. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so we mentioned rechargeable USB, so it has the port here. Wonderful. And they say this is waterproof. You can fully submerge it in water for. It's it said on here. I think up it's to said thirty up minutes. Thirty minutes. Yep. Yeah, it said to one meter for thirty minutes. Yep. So. And it will float. Hmm? They say I didn't try it because I'm borrowing this from somebody, and the guy who borrowed it to me would probably murder me. Yes. If, I, if something was wrong. It would not with be it. a good deal. Um. But did you say how long the battery lasts? Did it say on here? I'm not sure. If, yeah, it does say oh, on yeah. there. At the high beam, oh. 1.9 hours. Okay. okay. And at the low beam, 30 hours. 30 so. hours. Okay. And it has a little feature here where you can lock it in place, and they say that saves on the battery, too. Okay. So I have it locked in the high beam here, and you can't push the trigger anymore. Gotcha. Oh, that little switch. Okay. Yep. Um, has a built-in folding stand here, you know, if you need both your hands to hands work free. freely and, yep, and you can adjust kind of the angle of it. And okay. You don't want to shine somebody in the eyes with this because I did it to you. You did it to me the other day. And the guy yeah. who borrowed it, Brad, did it to me and it makes you it seriously, like, dizzy for a while. It took me a good while to get mm -hmm. back to my normal state. I didn't read through the manual completely, but I'm sure it says. Probably not to shine, not shine in, in eyes. people's eyes. So it's yeah. Very, the other very thing, strong. You, it has a drop test on here. It said drop tested onto concrete from one yep. meter above the, you know, the concrete without functional damage. Yep. So that's always a plus because who isn't dropping stuff, yep. you know? Yep. It's got this soft rubberized coating here, which mm -hmm. is kind of nice. Just, you know, just for it's the feel. It's very lightweight, too. Yeah, I very was surprised lightweight. when I went to pick it up, I was expecting it to be a little heavier. Mm hmm but it's very lightweight. Yep. It's got a little handle here. You could even put it around your neck if you wanted to. So you, don't, so you don't drop it. Yeah. Um, so in the world of spotlights, I think, I mean, for your money, 75, you could spend yeah. hundreds and obviously you're probably going to get a better quality spotlight, sure. but for 75 bucks, Christmas is coming up. Actually, this is one thing I might want. I didn't see any deer last. I'd say, whoop. Well, Type of times would this be good for deer hunting? Camping would probably be good. Camping you know, would be if nice. You're a little too, nervous yeah. to. Yeah, I would. Yeah, I'd say anytime you're out mm -hmm. in the woods or even maybe on your, on your bike. Would you use? Yeah, it? on your bike, you might. Yeah. 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 Oh. 
it, it's a crazy world out there. I mean, this could be self-defense even with that high beam. That like could. we said, it that really does beam, blind that, you. That blind does you. blind you for a while. All right, I think so. we've talked enough about it. What should they do out there? Subscribe to Subscribe. us. Subscribe. Send us your products if you have anything for us to review. It'll be free. And honest. And honest. Visit our website, freeandhonest.com. It's listed below. And you have a great day. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you.